Hey everybody, welcome back to another Jackson Jet Setting Resort Review. Today we're checking out the Sheridan Princess Kaiulani Hotel located right off of Waikiki Beach in Hawaii on the island of Oahu. Across the street is the Moana Surfrider Hotel, which is a sister property of the Sheridan. You can do room charges over there as well as the Royal Hawaiian, which is next door. Here's the main lobby. Um, the hotel itself is from the 60s, but they've done a great job, I think, renovating it and making it look all nice. I checked in as a Marriott Titanium. Um, I got a nice view over the pool. As a result, this hotel doesn't really have suites, so um, wasn't expecting a suite upgrade. Um, I also got free breakfast for two, which was taken at the Splash Bar, and it was to go. We were staying during COVID. Um, as you can see, the line for the elevator, that's a telltale sign that this review was done during the COVID era. Um, but in the main lobby off of it, there's a nice little game area with uh, some bags and um, foosball, so lots of activities for people. Despite the size of the property, relatively small, um, it did feel um, kind of like a resort. Um, but we're heading up to the second floor where a lot of the meeting rooms are. It's also where the fitness center is. Um, I thought they did a cre pretty creative thing um, and cordoned off a, a corner of this floor uh, for the fitness center. So you didn't have to uh, be squeezed into a small basement room or a small conference room um, that a lot of hotels do and we call it a fitness center. It's uh, pretty large. So around the hotel grounds, I could tell uh, there used to be some birds uh, here in an open air aviary. Um, it looked like uh, the sky was open, so I don't think that the birds are there anymore. Here's that splash bar. Um, you're able to uh, take some to-go food there and get coffee in the morning, overlooking the nice pool. Um, the pool itself is uh, pretty small for a hotel this size. Uh, towels were out, uh, chairs were all taken early in the morning, um, and it's easy to access directly from the street. There's no uh, real gate or uh, guard uh, protecting uh, the hotel guests from the general public. So just keep that in mind if you're thinking about relaxing at this hotel's pool. It's relatively small. So now let's take a look at what room we got. Uh, nice open air elevator lobby for, uh, for guests here. Um, and we stayed in room 420, which is located right next to the elevator. So pretty small room. Um, the bathroom itself was definitely unrenovated. Um, you can see me there in the mirror, but uh, full full size mirror for people getting ready. Uh, tiny, tiny bathroom um, with a lot of plastic and uh, you know not really a great shower head either. So keep that in mind if you're sharing a room with two people. Uh, it's not enough room even to store toiletries in there. We had a two uh, double bedroom. Um, you know, it's, it is what it is. It was, uh, under $200 a night in Waikiki during a very busy time, uh, for them. So, uh, no real complaints for us, uh, there. And we had a great view of the, uh, Moana Surfrider and the pool, uh, and a little balcony. So, you know, overall pretty nice for what you pay for. Um, there is still a, uh, resort fee here. Um, so keep that in mind. <laughs> 